In brighter news now, downtown Cleveland's population continues to grow despite higher costs of living, meaning downtown is a desirable place to live. Channel 3's Brandon Simmons tells us what's driving people downtown and if the trend is sustainable. Proximity, everything is right here in your backyard. That's the simple reason why Jonathan Wiggum decided to move downtown where he currently lives in this sphere at the corner of Chester Avenue and East 12th Street, one of many complexes advertising to people attracted to downtown living. And the rents remained affordable here in this building particularly. As supply and demand happens, you know, you'll see prices increase, but it eventually it'll level off. The downtown population has ballooned to over 16,000 people more than ever before with new construction going up across the city to help keep up with demand. We've seen a huge increase in the number of units uh, in downtown Cleveland in terms of housing. In fact, we have now close to 7,000 market rate uh, apartments in downtown Cleveland. But the market rate has gone up, increasing from $1.10 to $1.52 per square foot in recent years, an increase that speaks to rising demand and an increase that's enough to attract developers. Cleveland has, has been a relatively low cost market. So for us to uh, get more construction, like the beacon, which you, you see behind us, we actually have to increase uh, the, re the rental structure Structure so that developers can, in, in, in essence, put the financing together to allow projects like these to move forward. The only complaint from residents is that some of the suburban amenities are missing, but Mayor Nucci hopes the rise in population will help fix that. And the closer we get, for example, to 20,000 or 25,000 residents, the better retailers are going to be uh, uh, in terms of their comfort level in terms of moving into downtown. Making the higher rent prices even more acceptable. You hear the complaints from people who don't live there, but yet they're still filling up. So, I mean, something's working. <laughs> in Cleveland, I'm Brandon Simmons, Channel 3 News.